And Massachusetts voters for the first time elected a woman as their governor. 22 News reporter Kate Wilkinson is live at Maura Healy's campaign party. Kate, what's happening right now? And tonight, Democrats had quite a bit to celebrate. Just wrapping up on those festivities here, Maura Healy claiming victory. Something historic here, not just in the Commonwealth, but also in the nation as she becomes the first lesbian governor that is out in the country. Moments ago, she spoke with supporters who helped make history. Maura Healy has also become the first woman to be elected for the role here in Massachusetts. It has been a campaign where poll after poll has shown her ahead in both the primary and the general election. Tonight, she announced her commitment to the state, saying she will be a governor for everyone, whether you voted for her or not. She promised to make Massachusetts more affordable, strengthen infrastructure, and bring more clean energy to the state, adding she plans to protect a woman's right to choose. Our state will provide access to safe, legal abortion. We will protect women, we will protect patients, and we will protect providers, Massachusetts. Andrea Campbell also claimed victory tonight as the state's next attorney general. While celebrating here in Boston tonight, Healy did not mention if she has talked with her opponent, former state rep Jeff Deal. She did, however, say she plans to meet with Governor Baker and Lieutenant Governor Polito to begin the process of a smooth transition of power. She's expected to take over the role as governor January 5th. We're going to be live in Boston. Kate Wilkinson, 22 News. Okay, thank you. Healy easily defeated her Republican challenger in the race for Governor Jeff Deal. 22 News reporter Ellen Fleming is live from the Deal Party tonight in Boston with reaction from the crowd there. We are here at the Boston Harbor Hotel at Jeff Deal's campaign party. He just left the stage after saying he called Maura Healy to congratulate her. Shortly after 8 p.m., the race was called in favor of Democrat Maura Healy. When Deal addressed the crowd, he said he is going to stay fighting for his conservative ideals. Deal's journey to the top office started this past May when he earned the endorsement from the Mass GOP at the annual convention with 71 percent of support. There, he pledged to challenge liberal policies, and he has stuck to that pledge throughout his campaign. Currently, the polls show Jeff Deal at 35 percent. Attorney General Maura Healy is holding a strong lead at 63 percent. Deal, alongside his running mate Leah Cole Allen, ran on a platform of making Massachusetts more affordable, undoing vaccine mandates and what they are calling parental rights. But that was not enough to win against progressive Democrat Maura Healy and Kim Driscoll. Now, Massachusetts has made history tonight, electing the first female governor and lieutenant governor duo. Working for you live in Boston, I'm Ellen Fleming, 22 News.